What's up, it's your girl, Kirby Queen. It's early morning. I'm tired, I had a long day yesterday, but I'm here and got my stuff packed. Um, I'm gonna be carrying my Vera Bradley bag. This thing got so much room in it. I'm gonna show you guys right here, the inside of it. All right, I got one laptop in here. This is the Campus Extra Large backpack. And here, I got my planner. I like to take notes. And I got a bunch of manuals. M NLPE, I can't never get that acronym right. This, I like to take that. That was actually given to me. I know so many RDs, they've been giving me stuff that they think I may need. And here, in the inside of here, I have my iPad, iPad pencil, it fits directly in here. Got that in the inside of here. Gotta make sure. Then the inside, I'll be taking it. If I had the choice, I actually had two several different backpacks, but they didn't work for my needs. So I got this one. I got all this in here. Small calculator, Abbott, pocket guide, highlighters, sanitizer, more highlighters, pens more than enough space it's probably the best backpack i've had you know in here i don't have anything but it's a pocket here then back here right here i also have my personal laptop this is my personal one this is the one for work right here more than enough space and as you can see around the back it fits directly onto my luggage thing that's what i love most because i travel a lot and I want something that's um, convenient for me, where I can take and carry, especially with me being by myself. I don't have to worry about having several different bags. So all I gotta do is roll this and the backpack comes along or if you're in the airport, whatever. But I just wanted to show you guys that. And um, now I'm about to head out. Finally here, guys. Now it's time for me to get in here, check in the hotel, and do some homework. You know, my days never end. It's a little breezy here, probably because it's by the beach, but I'm glad I brought this <laughs> backpack like this because this would be so much to have to carry. But here at the hotel, Margaritaville Resort, see how this is. So this hotel has a resort. It's included with my stay. I probably won't have time to go because I'll be busy. But they do have a beach and stuff like that down there. But I'm so glad I bought this backpack before I came because this is a Vera Bradley. It's the extra large campus backpack. I got two laptops in here. Got It's heavy, but at least it fits on my luggage where I don't have to carry it. Get on this elevator. I don't know where I'm going. I'm just gonna find a lot, I guess. Well, I guess we're going to two then. It's 
nice van. Alright guys, finally I made it in. It's my room here. Show y'all the balcony. Y'all know I love staying at hotels, but I don't know. I'm on the 16th floor. I told the girl whichever view is the best to give it to me. So, and that's she did. Just got a balcony. I you have to watch a step because you'll trip. But this is a resort hotel. It's a little bit different than what we have in Texas. But you know, the, the water park not open, etc. And this place down here supposed to be opening up soon. But I won't be here to see it. Casinos and other hotels, you know, down there. Water. A lot of people come here during the summertime to the beach, as you can see down there. It goes a long while down there. But, anyways, just want to show you guys this is where I'm staying. I need to go to Walmart to get a money order. I'll let y'all see some more of the hotel. They had a bunch of restaurants and arcades and stuff like that. So, I'll show that to you guys as well. See here, mirror. Y'all know I love a good mirror. Check out this bathroom. I hadn't been in here. Light. It is. It's nice. Up here. This is the shower nice shower enjoy this but this is the room guys just want to show it to y'all this is margaritaville resort hotel i'm gonna close this balcony 16th floor lock it finally made it now it's time to do some homework it's been a long day a long long day guys but i'm here class in the morning good morning good morning good morning i'm extremely tired guys but the show must still go on i gotta get me a cup of coffee i don't drink coffee often but i'm gonna get me a cup this morning um because i'm still kind of tired to drive and you know it's early but up oh, about to grab me something to eat give me a cup of coffee and get my day started today is the day it's orientation day for my dietetic internship. So, about to finish getting ready and then I'm going to head out. I'll bring you guys along and show you guys as much as I can. I'm going to let y'all show the, see the view this morning as well from the hotel room. Now, I can't be out here long. It's breezy here because I'm by the water. As you can see. this van. I showed y'all this when I first came in. Cool colors, huh? That's the Golden Nugget right next door. They have a casino on there. The hotel that I'm at, it doesn't have a casino on it. But you can see how uh, blank the parking lot is because there's not a lot of people staying. And that's what I love. Not have to wait in line or anything like this. So now I got to head by Walmart and then head to first day of orientation. All right, guys. So I finally made it to my destination. I'm here at the place where we have our orientation at time for me to get in here i'll bring you guys along to show you as much footage as i can i'm not sure how this day gonna go but i'm here once i get done with today probably enjoy the city a little bit i'm not sure but i'm gonna go ahead and get in here and get into orientation i got about 15 to 20 minutes before orientation starts <laughs> Oh, 
Um, some um, side effect management, like I said previously, you're gonna slow the hydrate the patient through IV. Said it, um, but you wanna do it slowly so you won't give them too much fluid too fast because it will kind of help them create more abdominal distension if you overhydrate them too much too fast. You want to monitor them while they're on the uh, medication for a sign of delivery. Y'all know I had to find a gym. It's not much, but it's enough to get done what I need to get done while I'm here. Get a light little workout in tomorrow. Do a little something, something. Gotta find me a, with a gym at the first day when I get here. It's day two guys, day two. About to head in. Um, and get my day started. I may grab me a little cup of coffee. I feel a little bit better today, but um, about to get my day started. I've been enjoying it, you know, learning and doing every other thing I need to do. So about to head out, day two. All the kids is an arcade. This one restaurant over here, but I'm in Margarita via E. As I told y'all, it's empty because it's the menu. I told y'all it's empty because it's not a lot of people here, but I like it like that. I don't have to wait on my food to have me a drink. They got drinks, alcohol, good food. All right, guys, so that was the last day of orientation I'm done. Now it's time for me to head back home because I got to get back to work tomorrow. And I told y'all my days don't end. So let's hit the highway. Seven hours ahead of me, but we're going to get through it. With a little bit of music and a little bit of food or whatever I need, we're going to make it home. guys so i finally made it home it's been a long long ride it's seven o'clock p.m i left at about 11. it's 6 50 um now here so it's been a long ride i'm tired i gotta get up and go to work in the morning so your girl is about to head in the house but thank you guys for tuning in don't forget to like comment and subscribe stay tuned for my next video peace